I feel bad for Whitley. He's he 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 had any resentment for Weiss. He's not gonna have it even even more because Weiss now is the cause of their family breaking apart. Breaking apart. Mm -hmm. Granted. The family really wasn't together, but that's, in his eyes, that's true. But like, but in his eyes, yeah. But like, it's really like what? Weiss is causing a lot of grief in the family dynamic. Mm -hmm. Shit, I, I know for a fact and that so now I, Big now, Sister was proud of that moment. That was hilarious. That was I, one I, of my yeah. favorite Weiss moments ever. You're under arrest. Can I do that? <laughs> <laughs> like, I would have been like, I wouldn't been as satisfied if it was Winter. I would have, I, I would have mm -hmm. refrained from having Winter, like had that moment but at the same time i can understand it. no it was perfect because winter had already had like her big moment in the council meeting and so they kept it to where they're, they're still doing things with both characters and weiss is off with the mom and gathering the information so that they were still able to do satisfying things with both characters i, I know think. i know but like it's like they they put down winter. They, they they put down winter to bring up weiss uh, because winter has always been super calm and collected yes he she has a very fierce um personality. personality but like she was always been like by the book and she, mm -hmm. her having an her outburst her how her outburst, outburst like that um in comparison to weiss coming in and stopping the whole thing and just being super cool and collected and like mm -hmm. here i'm gonna prove show you proof and it's just like now it's awesome but at the same time it's like oh you kind of i feel i don't i, I don't completely agree that it's putting winter down but i get what you're saying yeah i feel like if anything it's uh, this is the longest that winter has been sharing a room with her father yeah in a long time yeah so probably like it's bringing back like she just had memories so it's uh -huh. like i swear i'm gonna slap this bitch you know like, that was like winter we've seen this volume that winter has the capacity to get heated in certain yeah. situations i mean she i mean fucking the, her fight with crow was, was a testament <laughs> to that. yeah for sure. No, uh, I, I love Winter. Like, she's... Yeah, yeah. I mean, like, I, I'm not going to say that it, it put her down, like, a lot. Like, if she was at 100, she went to 99. Yeah, yeah like, like, kind of like, it was, like, it was just a very small moment that, that kind of took away from her character being what, the up until this point, has been her character. The very mm. calm, collected, fierce, yet controlling of her emotions. And then, this, then this one moment, she just... I do, I do believe that he has to do just Burst. because he's the father. I, yeah, I, I honestly think true, it's just the which dad. Is, which is true. Which is true. Like, I'm not going to take away from that. Yeah. yeah. Um, but it's it's just that. Like, it was kind of like a, a little bit of a flip. Because normally I would yeah, expect... Yeah, between the two characters. Yeah. I would expect Weiss to be more outbursty, outbursty. Than, mm -hmm. than, than Winter. And I think she would be if she was in the room. I bet, yeah. I'm pretty sure she would. Welcome back, guys, to the Weeds Closet. And today... We're watching episode eight, ten. Ten. Holy shit! I'm two episodes behind uh, of volume to, seven. I need you to reset. Then... Elna, and we are out in the open. Uh, yeah, out in the open with. So is it, is it okay? Is your fly open? If you're if, if you watched the last episode, you know. So stop, you know, stop, stop, stopping us from watching this episode. So like, let's just go in, get, get it. Alrighty, guys, check our Twitch, Twitter, and Patreon if you want to say hey. From the moment you join our Patreon, you get access to the uncuts of all the different shows that we've done, as well as access to our Discord, where you get to chat with us or amongst yourselves about any games, shows, or movies. If you choose to jump into our Weep Titan tier, you'll have access to our time-exclusive shows. These shows will either be ahead or unavailable to watch in our YouTube. Attack on Titan used to be there, Jujutsu Kaisen just finished, Mob Cycle is starting, and Invincible has been over there for over a year. And for the Full Metal Weeps, not only do you get shown off here, but you get one week early access to the shows currently on the screen, as well as staying ahead into our bi-weekly podcast, and you also get to vote and watch our monthly Anka movie. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day, and let's start the video. Oh, and Mercury kills all the Ruby team, and... Oh, good. It. Whoa, 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 whoa! And it's up to Oscar. I will say this, <laughs> Ironwood took the whole Salem not being killable a lot better than, better than I thought he was. <laughs> I mean, that poor man was shook though. Hey. Like, <laughs> I mean, it's like, he stop it. He's already dead, you know? Bro, I, I uh, would not have taken it as well as him. I mean, you, you guys heard me in volume six. I was, let's kill Oscar. <laughs> 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 Oh, and uh, yeah, we haven't seen the kiss between the two glorified men, the lucky boys. Bro, it's gonna happen. No, it's gonna be a three-way. 
Wait, with, with who? With who else? With Ironwood. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I Dude, I, I see it now. Like good, the like crow and the good luck guy are gonna be in bed together, and then <laughs> I was gonna walk in with the towel on, and be like, "Hey, boys." <laughs> <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> just, <laughs> <laughs> and then, and then, you just see the shadow of it. Then, it's uh, like ginormous. And then, like you know, Alpha Alpha already knows, but like crow's gonna be like, "Whoa!" <laughs> so that's why they call you Ironwood. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's see how good you do, Mr. <laughs> Alpha. <laughs> Crow just like calls. He's like, <laughs> God damn it. We're like my hero fans, but with Ruby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Look, funny. it's nobody's fault but the show. Like, they've set it up so well. They did. Okay, okay. I dig this music, yeah. Come on, Penny. Bro, like, there has to be people dead, dead. Redeem yourself, Penny. I need you to be combat ready, Penny. No, we can't say that. It's spoiler. Oh, th th oh, yeah, it is spoiler. Bro, this is just as bad as Beacon. Shh. Or worse. I would say just as bad. I, to be I mean, I guess it's the end of the They didn't have the dragon. They didn't have the dragon. No! Holy bro. Show. There's so many. Oh, the Happy Hunters is... Ah, yes. Damn, she landed on her ass. <laughs> that would hurt. There's yeah. a... There's a uh, aura, aura. She has ass. She, she has an ass she of got, steel. She got them cheeks. Thunder thighs. No, Thunder thighs is the other lady, according to Nora. No, it was uh, the group pairing, I think it was. Ah, yeah, Team Thunder thighs, yeah. Nice. Oh man, her fucking like new a bit. Oh my god. Oh good. shit. <laughs> so good. Damn. Bro. Try running with that much weight on you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh shit. Yeah. Oh okay. So, yeah, Yang is Yang is definitely gone from like complete tank to like tactical. Like she's, a, she's an invasive yeah. tank ish. Mm. Like, let me just fucking deal the damage and be good while she's doing a, it. She's like Doomfist almost. Pretty good comparison. Okay. Yes. <laughs> that's his, that, that's it. Like, that's Crow's uh, Stormtrooper aim right there. Let's go. He's like, I, I usually just use the sword or the, the fucking uh, scythe. Oh shit. Why isn't even hiding it now? She's like, oops, my bad. I'm just not that good. <laughs> I need like a an like another hunter's team to show up. That'd be so dope. Like team uh funky. Mm. Shit. Oh, okay, here we go. The fucking lie detector. But it is all true. An ancient and terrible evil lies outside of our kingdom. The screen is cropped. You can't tell if he's lying or telling the truth here. The attack on Haven and for the Talk recent dude. attacks on Mantle. This powerful force goes by the name of Salem. He's doing it. Salem seeks only to divide us. To turn us against each other. Nice. Hey, bro, that was a good combo. Shield tackle. We will lure in the grim and destroy ourselves. Salem herself does not work alone. Nice. Minions have invaded our very city. Arthur Watts and Tyrion Kalos. These men are the ones responsible for the recent murders in Mantle and for sabotaging the heating grid. But we cannot let ourselves give in to fear and panic. That is what she wants. Instead, we must unite and fight back together. Every single one of us. All right, single file line. Place a hand on the shoulder in front of you. Eyes forward. Move. Move. Ooh, look at that. Where did you learn to do that? Community service. 
Ah, nice. Bro, yeah. James get this past me. The council and I have decided to evacuate everyone in Mantle to Atlas. I'm withdrawing all defenses from Amity in order to assist with propelling the Grim in Mantle. We must put aside our differences and band together to defeat this threat. I fully support General Ironwood's plan. <laughs> that still doesn't make me safe, though. <laughs> it's like the dead robot that's like, yeah! Tin soldier's heart has cost him his mind. You need to keep their attention on Mantle for as long as possible. You want more chaos than a grim invasion. If anyone on Remnant could deliver that, wouldn't it be you? If you've made it to your local shelter, stay put. Help is on the way. <clears throat> and for those of you in Sector 17, I'll be seeing you personally. Come to think of it, I do have an idea. I still can't believe those idiots beat us here. Vacuo was supposed to be the next target. The timeline has changed. You said the farm boy has the lamp? Find him. Take it. No! No! We get what I need first. Then we get what we want. Now go. Ironwood's been hiding the Winter Maiden for years. Tonight I'm going to find her. The General's as predictable as his androids. He'll threaten what he has, and he'll flock to protect it. I did like that little, like, uh, ship that happened in the last episode between Oscar and Ruby. Moment. Uh, I mean, it's not necessarily like. Setting stone right, but they had like the little <laughs> butterflies talking yeah, to each other. Whatever, whatever. Ruby, uh, fucking Penny's here. <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna die anyways. <gasps> Bro. No oh, shit, fucking Ice Age. Ah, uh, what the fuck? Oof. Mm. All right, we just need to get everyone to the closest air pad. The closest LZ is that way. <laughs> there. Damn. So, Big Papa. Boy. Nice. Are we going to? Not yet, not yet, not yet. It's too OP of a move. Good damn. Penny, uh, are you okay? Ouch. <laughs> okay. <laughs> they sure are dangerous. They sure are. I think I have a plan. What is it? Okay. <laughs> Oh fuck. No oh, no, not her. Oh. No, no. No. Over here, you big bag of bones. She got the insults now. Huh. Man. As one tough customer. That's dope. It's fucking cool. Fucking Green Lantern right here. Oh, 
Oh. 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 Damn. Oh. 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 Fuck. Dado. Yeah, damn. Yeah, they saved us. <laughs> Fuck the Aesops. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody likes their pair of dresses anyway. Great work, Penny. Over and out. Make sure you get these people to safety. I'm gonna check for any stragglers. Hmm. Oh man, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Why so serious? For such a little bird, you have quite the impact around here. Bringing hope and a smile. Wherever you go. Uh, what? I find it upsetting. <laughs> Good luck. Bad luck. Sorry, Callos. Oh yeah. I really wanted to pummel you on my own, but the general insisted I share. Well, you're not the only one with a grudge. You'll both have to get in line. Don't tell me he's already there. Oh yeah. Bro. Hmm. This will certainly do the trick. Although I wouldn't exactly call it finished. Oh shit. Arthur Watts. <laughs> yeah, if, if Ironwood doesn't fight shirtless, I'm not watching the fight. You're gonna have to skip it. I need that devil man. Or the devil may cry. Ironwood. No. Truly. Even before you went and uh, did all this. The different types of dust, the biome system, and of course... Everything that goes into controlling them. Mm, bug, dude. You always were a pain in the ass. Oh. <laughs> This is some boss level shit right here. Yeah. <clears throat> Wait, does he have like a magnum as well? Yeah, bro. At the risk of sounding cliche, James. Oh shit. Going down without a fight. It's a mirror match. What? <laughs> <laughs> that was the whole what? Uh, it'll be short, huh? On, on your take. <laughs> Jake is like ah, another one. We just another one. Bro, I don't think the camera captures it that well, but like Jake is red. <laughs> <laughs> I mean we have to leave something for next time, right? Yeah. Jeez. Because we're we're Cause I, I don't we, think we'll be able we to gotta, finish we, it. We gotta lay out the timetable so that we can get reinforcements for volume eight. Oh, sure. gravity! The next episode's called Gravity, dude. You know what that means? Uh, that it's gonna be taken away, and it's gonna fall. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Oh my god, dude! I have so many like things that could happen. Nico, I gotta know like where, like how much do you like this volume? Like based off your first viewing, I I honestly think I liked it way more than all of them. Like this is probably my top tier um, um volume. Really? Wow. Yeah. So like if I were to scale them in terms of like my top, I don't know, five or three, this would be the first, followed by probably between volume six or volume three. Okay. And then the other one will be subsequent to that one. 
And I, if anything, volume five. Okay. So you're actually you're actually a pretty big fan of like the later stuff. Yeah, like I like the old stuff, the first few, but because I do like their fights, mm -hmm. but the fights cannot hold the vo whole volume, unfortunately. Like I, I do love the the plot between all of it, plus the fights. And five, the fights were eh, are not so good compared to six and seven. Mm -hmm. But then volume three's fights were decent, although that they were already losing their touch a little bit. Mm -hmm. But the story of three was really fucking good. So volume two has, if anything, the best fights in terms yeah. of choreography, uh, choreography whatever. But then, like, you have the fight with Adam and uh, and the two girls and and Ru um, well, fucking Blake and Yang. I cannot even yeah. think of the names. And that fight was amazing, yeah. and I loved it. Uh, and then on this one, volume uh, seven, we had the fuck. Is it this one? I mean, there's been a few really good ones in here. Yeah. They've oh, uh, the 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 training area arc, you know, mm -hmm. between them was pretty nice and interesting. Yeah, dude. This I'm into it. It seems like we get we get that uh pa Papa Ironwood fight next. So that's gonna Bro, be I, like I need I need Ironwood to fucking. <laughs> yeah, dude, I will never forget. That's one of the top Ruby moments where like Ironwood's like in the middle of the smoke and then he like rises up and he's just like fucking. The Giga Chad with the gun, dude. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. <laughs> That's great. Oh god, man, there's so much going on. Like everything with Neo Cinder. You got Ironwood, Oscar. What's he doing? Um, the only thing that could make this crazy crazier if Salem was just like, I am here also. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, that that, and we we also have Willie running Willie away. Willie running Willie, away. Willie why? Knows what that yeah. means. Holy shit, like, do you fucking imagine if Willie like gets on a mech to break his father out? Thanks for watching another Weeps Closet reaction. And a special thanks to our Patreons for keeping this channel going. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and we'll see you in the next one.